This is Farah Ramahad and his mother and his father and his brother Nizar. My name is Farah Ramahad and I'm from Afghanistan. It's a very beautiful country in the heart of Asia. It has very nice, peaceful, hospitable, brave, innocent, war threatened and poor people. I am from Ningahar, the border province of Afghanistan and Pakistan. We were living a peaceful life, everyone was happy and everything was okay. Suddenly, a plan was made by the Russians and they invaded our homeland. A war started, a holy war against the Russians. My father started fighting for his country as a pure Afghan. They fought with the Russians for more than 10 years and won. I was a very small boy during this time. I was a kid who didn't know anything. We lost our father. My mother searched for my father. She asked many people. She had many problems. Everything was destroyed. Our lives were in danger. Our future was destroyed because we lost our father. My mother confirmed that our father had died. That was the darkest period in our history. We didn't have anyone to look after us. Okay. Then the Taliban took control of Afghanistan. They stopped all women from working, studying and having a normal life. Our problems became more and more and we didn't have anyone to give us, it, give us something to make a living. Although we were from the Khan family. At this time, my brother and me were studying at school. We were studying English language courses and computer courses. My elder brother, Nizar Amahad, left our beloved country and came to the UK because he didn't want to fight against our own Afghan brothers. My mother didn't want him to go on fighting. When I was 15, I was old enough to look after my family, but my mother was afraid and made arrangements for me to leave and join my brother. I remember the day I left my mother. I looked at my mother and could see her crying because we didn't know when we would see each other again. I love my family, I love my country and my people with whom I could never fight. It's impossible to fire even one bullet towards my Afghan brothers, even if they're wrong. That's why my mother wanted me to leave Afghanistan. I walked for several hours in deserts, mountains, In dark nights, in forests, rain, cold weather and hunger. I spent many nights underground, without any bed or blanket, with very little food to survive on. I feared and worried for my life, but I was not upset for myself because I am a man, a man that never gives up. I think I was on my way for more than two months. <laughs> I made it to the UK. I found my brother and went to see him. We were reunited. I stayed with him and he welcomed me open arms into his house. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it has started. <laughs> I'm and I'm from Afghanistan. <laughs> March across and turn towards us and shoot when you get bored of you. Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, Shark, you ruined an your shot. You're an Afghanistan Time. Okay. Time. I and my brothers and sisters were studying at school. We were studying English language courses and computer courses.
desert. Up mountains. In dark nights. In forests. Rain, cold, weather. And hunger.